Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when audio is not working with the game on your Windows computer. To fix it before trying any troubleshooting steps, you can try this. Make a right click and then select manage. Now click on browse local files. It will take you to the game installation folder. Over here, you can see ms spatial dot dll file. You can just copy this folder, create a backup. Uh, you can just paste it to the desktop. Uh, now, once you have a backup created, now you can rename this file or you can even delete this file so make a right click and then you can rename it or you can delete it so i will just rename it now once you rename it you can launch if that does not work you can even uh, delete this file and then you can launch the game and then check the song if you face any problem you can always put the file back because you already have a backup so you can put it back if you face any problem still audio is not working properly then please follow the rest of the steps shown in this video now the first step is to press Windows plus G and then select the right audio device. So press Windows plus G on the keyboard. Now once you press Windows plus G, go to audio. So here you can see click on audio. If you see an audio tab, you can simply click on the audio tab. Now over here go to mix and here you can see Windows default output. Under this, select your audio device. You might see multiple audio device over here. Make sure that you select the audio device which you're using. So in my case, I'm using this one. And here you can see different application also over here. And if you see the game over here, then make sure it is set to the, the speaker. The slider is set to maximum. I'm showing you with different application, but you will see your game. If the game is running, you will see the game over here. Set it to maximum. Now go to voice. Now over here also select your audio device. So here you can see multiple. Make sure that you select your audio device over here for default communication output. Also select your audio device. I'm using this one. So sometimes we have different devices selected over here. So select your audio device. And once you select your audio device, now you can launch the game and then check. Now the next step is to make sure volume is not on mute sometimes like we have on mute so make a right click on the bottom right here you can see the speaker icon make a right click on the speaker icon and then click on open volume mixer and over here you will see your game if the game is running you will see the game over here if the game is not running you will not see it but if the game is running so launch the game and then you can come to volume mixer over here and then for your game make sure it is set to 100 so set the slider to 100 for your game now also select the right audio device in sound settings so make a right click on the speaker icon on the bottom right and then go to sound settings and over here also you will under choose where to play sound you can see so over here you, you might see multiple sometimes we have controller connected sometimes we have any other audio device which you're not using so select your audio device for me this is the right one and then make sure this is set to 100 and scroll down for input also if you're using microphone in that case select your microphone over here and then the right audio device over here and then also make sure the volume is set to 100 and then you can check the sound launch the game and then check the sound next step is to restart the game and restart your computer so if the game is running Close the game, restart the game. If that does not work, restart your computer and then check the sound. Next step is to set sound sample rate to 48, 44,000 hertz in sound control panel. So type in control panel in Windows search box and then go to control panel. Now go to hardware and sound. Now click on sound over here. This will open sound control panel. Now over here you have to select your audio device make sure that you select your audio device over here and then make a right click and then go to properties now over here go to ad advanced option now over here select you can try 40 48 or 44000 so you can select this for me it's uh, you can try this 24 bit 48000 hertz if that and then you hit apply and then click on OK. If that does not work, you can even try 24 bit 44,000 hertz. Hit apply. Click on yes. And then you can 
launch the game and then check but for me i will just keep it for 24 48000 hertz hit apply click on okay and then you can launch the game and then check now the next step is to now if you use if you are playing with controller disconnect your controller and then connect the controller launch the game and then once you hear the sound now you can connect the control also if you have any external devices which you are not using so if you have multiple usb adapter dongle connected disconnected and then launch the game now the next step is to turn off spatial sound now for this again type in control panel in windows search box and then go to control panel go to hardware and sound click on sound and over here you have to select your speaker make sure that you select your speaker and then select properties and then go to spatial sound if this is set to windows sonic you can turn it off and then click on okay and or you can do the vice versa if it is already set to off then you can try windows sonic and then check now the next step is to now if you have these application like aculus or voice meter or any other audio device in that case you can disable it in sound control panel and disable it in the device manager now again type in control panel in windows search box and then go to control panel and then go to hardware and sound and then go to sound now over here some sometimes we have multiple uh, audio device over here so make sure that you your the speaker which you are using should be should have a green tick the rest you can disable in my case here you can see uh, you can see this headphone aculus so i will just make a right click and disable it i'm not using it so you can you can always enable whenever you want to enable you can simply make a right click and enable it but while playing the game if you want you can disable it so i'm not using this this headphone i'm not using voice meter so i will disable everything so disable audio device which you are not using now once you disable all the audio device which you are not using now you can launch the game but make sure your audio device is set to default so you can make a right click and if the default option is highlighted set default now you can do the same thing in the recording tab so if you have any other audio device disable it and then make sure that your only the audio device which you are using has a green tick now for me i don't want to use this aculus so i will just disable it so disable and then you can do the same thing in device manager make a right click in the start menu and then go to device manager and then expand sound video and game controllers and i am using this real tech and rest i am not using so i will just make a right click and disable it you can always enable it whenever you want simply make a right click and enable it so i am not using this aculus i will disable it disable if you have this nvidia which you are not using you can disable it and i will disable these i'm not using these audio devices make sure that you restart your computer after this i will not restart right now click on yes once you disable it make sure only your speaker is enabled so in my case it is enabled now you can launch the game and then check the sound next step is to uncheck hands free telephony now for this copy this command this command is provided in the video description copy it type in run in windows search box and then click on run box and then paste the command over here and then click on okay and over here you will find your speaker so you will find a speaker over here this is just an example i am selecting my speaker so select your speaker or headphone which whatever you are using and then go to properties and then go to services over here so go to the services tab now over here you will see hands free telephony so you have to uncheck this hands free telephony and then hit apply and then click on okay now you can launch the game and then check the sound 
Now the next step is to install audio driver. Now first of all try it in device manager. Make a right click on the start menu and then go to device manager. Expand, expand sound, video and game controller. Select your audio device and then make a right click and then click on update driver and then click on browse my computer for drivers and then click on let me pick from uh, available drivers on my computer and then now over here you can select your audio device and then click on next install it and then restart your computer and then check the sound you can also do this on your system manufacturer website so if you have dell computer go to dell if you have lenovo go to dell lenovo so go to your system manufacturer website and find your select your model number and then find your audio driver and then install it from your system manufacturer website and then restart your computer and then you can check the sound so the last step is to verify the game files make a right click on the game select properties go to install files tab and then click on verify integrative game files once the verification is 100 percent complete launch the game and then check the sound so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to fix the audio issue with the game so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel